from the United States. From Morocco. From Japan. From England. From Buenos Aires, Argentina. From Pakistan. I'm from Spain. I'm from Russia. From Peru. From Nepal. From Seoul, South Korea. From Vietnam. We come from Nepal. Hi guys, so I am Katie Pham from Nepal University. Today I'm gonna make a dish from my country, which is Vietnam. And that dish I'm gonna introduce to you today is spring roll. So in Vietnamese we call it gong gong, but spring roll is like the popular name in English and probably and probably you have heard of it, I think. So I'm gonna tell you how to make that dish. It's really simple and takes a little time, so you can make it anytime that you want. Rice paper, three white rice vermicelli, lettuce, salt, onions. So first, we're gonna need to boil the water to cook the vermicelli. So now I'm opening the box of the vermicelli so that I can put it in the bowl and then we can pour the hot water into it later It has been like 3 minutes and now the water has been boiled so I'm gonna pour it into this bowl and wait for about one and a half minutes so that like the vermicelli can get flattened out and soft okay now the vermicelli has been submerged in the water we just need to wait for about one and a half minutes now we're waiting for the hot water to cool down we also prepare a bowl of cooked water and so that we can put the vermicelli into this bowl, bowl later now you gotta put the vermicelli into cold water, but remember, no more than two seconds. Okay, next for the spring, we're gonna boil it later, so now I'm opening this box. You can see a lot. And so I'm gonna put it into the steamer. Maybe just have a bit. We need to pour some water into it. And now I'm gonna pour some salt into it. You don't need too much, just a little bit. Okay, so now I'm gonna boil the stream. You just need to turn this on and wait for some minutes, about like 10 minutes, I think. Okay, so now next into the lettuce, I'm going to wash it so that we can eat it later. For the lettuce, we don't need it to be cooked, but we just need to like pull it out like this and then wash it and then let it be like this and we can already eat it. This is the green onion. We can just wash it and then use it together with the lettuce. So now I'm gonna wash it first and then I will pull out the first part. And they're ready to use. Alright guys, now we already have all the ingredients needed. The only thing left is the rice paper. So how do we do with them? First, we need to wet them. I'll put them here. And I'm just gonna have some water over it. And you will use your finger to spread the water so that the water can reach all the rice paper. Just a little bit at this end. You don't need to use too much water. If you put too much water into the rice paper, then it, then for about a minute later, the rice paper will get really soft and you cannot wrap them at all. So I think this is enough. Then I'm just gonna put 
so green, maybe green. Okay, and let's just put them in the middle. And then we need some lectures to keep the wrap open and beautiful. And then add this. This is the fresh emily. Don't worry if your rice paper is still a little bit too hard. The only thing you should be worried about is if it gets too soft and you cannot wrap it at all because if it's still a little bit hard like this, you can still make it wetter later. But I think now it's good. So now I'm just gonna put one here. So now as I'm wrapping this, I'm gonna tell you about like the dish origins. So basically, Spring roll stems from like the central part of Vietnam. So I, I myself live in the southern part, and this this is from the central part. But usually, like people all around Vietnam eat this, so we're all familiar with this. It's just like each part of Vietnam will have like a different variation of this. So maybe they will add some pork, or maybe they will have like different kind of dipping sauce. Okay, I haven't done the dipping sauce, but I'll show you later. But personally, like the overall of the spring roll, which is like half a lettuce and some cream and just like the vermicelli like this, you see, it's like the basic. The center part of Vietnam also have like a lot of different kind of dishes and it's good. I myself love the bún bò huế, which is a kind of spicy noodles, but I don't know why it's not popular in the US. Maybe people just cannot like eat spicy food at all. And so spring roll, which is more like green and easier to eat, is getting more popular. But I really love like the spicy noodles. You should try it sometime. So when I was a little kid, my mom used to drive me to like different restaurants. She has like a soul for food as well. And so I myself tried a lot of different dishes, but Gongguan, which is spring roll, which is this, is remains one of my favorite. That restaurants they have a lot of like different cousins, like from the spicy noodle that I have just told you to this and to like different kind of Food. Usually for for spring roll, we should usually use it like as like a, like a first dish in the meal, so that it's easier for people to like have something fresh first, and then they will continue to eat the main dish. And so the main dish may be like the spicy noodle that I just told you, but this one for its fresh nature is they keep it as like the appetizer, and I think it's a really good choice. Okay guys, so finally now we come to the dipping sauce. So usually in Vietnam people will use either the fish sauce or another kind of sauce when they eat the spring roll but because I couldn't buy it, we didn't have enough time to prepare. So here I am preparing some sauce from the Indomie um, instant noodle. I know it's really funny but I think it tastes good and so I think maybe why not we try. And so now I'm just gonna mix them all together. Oh, it looks so good, guys. All right, guys. Now it's time to enjoy what we have made. So here are like our successful like what we have did before. So I'm just gonna try it first. Just 
just dip it like this. Mm. It's very good lab. Mm. Wow. It's been a long time since I have tried this. So last summer I went to Vietnam and then I have some of them but it's like at the start of summer and now it's already September. I miss this so much. So I'm gonna have another bite. So yeah, to talk about spring roll, it's really something that you should try to make at once sometimes when you have free time because it's really quick to make. You can have only spend like 20 minutes to make it and then you have a really fresh dish like this. Like, I mean like it's amazing and it's really healthy for you as well. So why not try it? And also if you can try to visit Vietnam someday and you will and you will have a chance to like try more dishes as well. Most of them will have like vegetable and herbs and like green stuff. And so if you are into something green, then Vietnam is definitely the place for you to come because we have many dishes and all of them always have like this kind of like green things for you to try. So bye guys, maybe you can make some for yourself.